Domino workspaces are where both data scientists and low-code users can collaborate to create models or perform exploratory analysis in notebooks. These code sessions allow for one-click access to the software, hardware, and data they want, without any DevOps work, in an open, flexible, yet governed system. By design, Domino's compute environments allow you to easily update and share packages and tools, while being safely contained in a sandbox that can be governed or defined by IT. And these are automatically versioned, so you can always run passcode, even years later. I can then choose from a number of integrated development environments, or code editors, a subset of which is shown here. The ability to move between licensed tools such as MATLAB and open source editors like JupyterLab without needing to migrate my code, data, or collaborators is one of the many things that sets us apart. I then select the hardware I need, and it's easy to scale up to larger or GPU machines, even mid-session. You can even choose infrastructure in different regions, cloud providers, or on-premise. Domino supports multi- and hybrid cloud infrastructure. My admins can also control what hardware is shown, restricting certain machines or servers to different groups. Launching a workspace orchestrates all my infrastructure and software, so I don't need to be an expert in cloud, Kubernetes, or compute frameworks. I get to use my preferred development tool, JupyterLab in this case, but Domino is linked in all my materials, like my code, which can be stored in Domino or come from any number of external Git repositories and data, so I don't have to worry about finding connection strings installing drivers, or moving data between servers. I can track my compute usage and easily change hardware tiers when I'm ready to train my model. And we support your code generation tools of choice, such as JupyterAI, Copilot, or our built-in integrations for AutoML and Hugging Face Foundation models. Everything around my notebook session is saved, so my collaborators can easily replicate my settings, or I can go back to past commits when needed. We can pull and push to the same project, collaborating in real time, and it's easy to save results to various formats, such as PDFs or images, and share those with stakeholders. Next, we'll discuss data science techniques. Domino's AI Hub has notebooks with numerous examples for various data science techniques and allows companies to build their own custom templates as well. Here we can see some examples, including our time series analysis, computer vision, and financial modeling. Our environments include best-in-class tools, such as Scikit-Learn, PyTorch, and TensorFlow, so it's easy to set up things like ensemble models and gradient boosting. I can even use the Code Assist to create hyperparameter searches without needing to write anything myself. Our customers also use Domino for simulation work, such as Monte Carlo, seen here, and other algorithms. Next, we'll transition to the machine learning capabilities. Domino ships with AutoML, based on the FAST library for automated machine learning and tuning, or FLAML, and numerous foundation models. This AutoML integration finds accurate models or configurations with low computational resources for common ML and AI tasks. It can create algorithms with different supervised learning techniques, such as random forest and gradient boosting, and will let you compare different models and hyperparameters, labeling the best performer based on your chosen metrics. Data scientists aren't locked into using this tool. They can get started with any open source tool they prefer, or use our integrations with commercial products, including DataRobot, SAS, H2O, and MATLAB. For deep learning, we have a number of PyTorch and TensorFlow examples, and our foundation models quickly bring in various pre-trained models and set up the fine-tuning for NLP and computer vision tasks. Our environments also bake in tools for reinforcement learning, including Ray, Kiras, and OpenAI Gem, among others. For explainability, we integrate with vendors such as Fiddler and Arise AI, and also include a toolbox in our templates with options for model fairness and error analysis, interpretability, and data exploration options, such as counterfactual analysis and data balance. Next, we'll move into the user interaction demo section. Domino's workspace tools come out of the box with support for the natural language-driven interfaces JupyterAI and VS Code's Copilot. This gives users a native UI to build a wide range of AI and Gen AI applications using foundation models from Anthropic, AI21, OpenAI, and Cohere. In JupyterAI, I can ask the model to explain and generate code, fix errors, and generate entire notebooks from a natural language prompt. And VS Code in Domino has a number of options for debugging and speeding up code generation. Next, we'll move into experiment tracking. 
looking at how Domino compares the performance of multiple training runs for model optimization. Every project includes an experiment manager, which shows automated visualizations of model performance, helping to identify the best performing models and troubleshoot issues. Collaboration is made easy since you and all of the contributors to your project can send runs to the same experiment for comparison, nesting linked models when needed. It's easy to compare multiple experiments and to examine different performance metrics. The MLflow-based experiment manager integrates directly with PyTorch, TensorFlow, Scikit-Learn, and other popular packages, and can be completely customized as well. We provide a number of notebooks with sample code for data scientists, and low-code users can set these up with our Code Assist wizard for standard machine learning and more complex foundation models. Every aspect of the experiment is saved, including the hardware, all packages and software, the training time, and the model itself. And these can be registered to a model card for discovery and reviews from your stakeholders, along with one-click deployment options. 